Hey friend, this is Brandon here with This Is Tech Today, and I'm here with the lovely Hannah Parrott, and she's helping me check out the new Moment Telelens, the 58 millimeter. Have you ever modeled before? No. Surprise, Hannah is a composer, and she composed the intro to this video. Thanks. So Moment sent out a bunch of cases and their brand new 58 millimeter tele lens to check out. If you're not familiar with who Moment is, they do make cases for cell phones, but it goes way beyond that. They make a bunch of really high quality lenses for your smartphone camera. All you have to do is take the lens and twist it onto their case and you're good to go. So fun fact, I've never tried to do a dedicated photo shoot before. And with Hannah not having any modeling experience before, we just decided to have fun with it. We decided to see if we could take some interesting shots using only one building as our setting. And we use this alleyway for a little bit but we're quickly losing light so we ran to the roof and of course if you're heading up to the roof you have to get a stairway shot once we got to the roof we found this really cool fence that added some nice texture to our backdrop and then let's have you like right up against it oh and uh, if you haven't noticed Hannah is a uh, really tall I like this light <laughs> <laughs> While the sun was setting, we decided to move over to the other side of the building and see what kind of shots we could get there. Bring it down just a touch. <laughs> Gotta get in the frame. <laughs> Seriously, look like a nut. <laughs> Alright, just like that because you have the backlighting of the, the sun. It's got that like nice hair light. So one tip that I would have for you while you're taking pictures is just joke around and have fun. You're always trying to go for like smooth like instead of like rigid like angles and stuff like that. Like you're kind of like trying to go for like smooth. <laughs> Now, beyond just looking for interesting things in a setting, you can bring different props. I don't know what I'm doing, but I'm gonna try it. We'll have you stand right here. And there's one little thing that I saw on Mango Street where they just used a bag, so I decided to give that a shot. Have it like kind of like a loose twirl. Shout out to Mango Street. This shot turned out amazing. We also tried a different perspective where she was laying on the ground, and uh, well, it was kind of hard to do that. I uh, almost fell over. <laughs> <laughs> We tried to find different things on this rooftop to give some interest, so we found this ladder here. Uh, point it towards me, like the glasses. I know that changing perspective really adds a lot of interest to your photos, so I tried things where she's climbing up the ladder, and then I tried to get a few shots pointing down. I really think these turned out really well, and having those sunglasses as a prop also helped out a lot. One of the biggest reasons why I love using the Google Pixel is because you can use moment lenses on it and retain the ability to use portrait mode. Since it just has a single lens, you're able to do that easily. So this photo is taken with the moment tele lens without portrait mode enabled. And then here's the same shot with portrait mode enabled. I think it looks really good. So you might be wondering why do you want to use a tele lens over something like a wide angle lens? For portrait shots it can compress the image in certain ways that's kind of unflattering like uh, my big nose becoming way bigger. So this is the only shot in this video not using a moment lens. This is straight out of the Pixel 3 XL. And then using the tele lens it helps you get way closer to your subject. Of course you can use it for things like architecture, but I really enjoy using it for portraits. It was starting to get really dark out, so I brought out these fairy lights that I found on Amazon that were really inexpensive. I think they add a lot of interest to the images. If you want to get your hands on them, there are links down below in the description. Also, who's getting some Gal Gadot vibes here? Let us know in the comments. And if you need any music composed, Hannah's website and Instagram are in the description. What's your style or what do you make music for? I make music for films and TV and video games. Like <laughs> Thanks so much to Moment for sending these out to me. If you want to get your hands on any of their cases or their lenses, their links are in the description as well. I hope you enjoyed coming alongside Hannah and I as we figure out this whole photo shoot thing. If you enjoyed this, please share and subscribe and hit that bell icon to be notified of when I post a new video. As always, thank you for watching This Is Tech Today. Until next time. How tall are you really? <laughs> Just <stick up. laughs>